Hello, my beautiful labor dragons. Welcome to your mid-October reading. So, my beautiful Libras, happy birthday. Um, I think we're just squeaking in before we get into Scorpio. Uh, so, anyways, let's see here. So... I always get mixed up between the 21, 22, and 23 for every month. It's like, when does it change over again? So they could have made it easy, but <laughs> um, what was I going to say? Oh, guys, so I've had COVID. Yay. But So I'm recovering, but I don't think I'm going to have time for bonuses. So please just please love me and like and subscribe and support my channel. I do appreciate it. I really do. If I was just, I was out for... I think about 10 or 12 days I was I was out and I'm still pretty exhausted. So I'm trying to get these readings out for you guys. So we have exchanging gifts. Well, that would make sense because it's your birthday. <laughs> Clean it up, Treasure Island and round and round. So I think that there's something that um, that's that you're focusing on your happiness. Here's what I'm getting the thing to do. So you have happiness, right? You have this vision of happiness. There's something you need to take care of. And it's something that keeps circling back. And you really are being guided to deal with it. Okay, so this is sort of what I'm seeing this, right? So it's like, I think exchanging gifts is probably simply because it's your birthday. It could have something to do with somebody who gave you presents or whatever. But um, yeah, so Treasure Island, clean it up and round and round. So let's go ahead and get some cards. Yeah, so something uh, something was beyond your control, that's for sure. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah, something was a little bit chaotic. Um, definitely out of control. Nine of Wands, which came out very sideways so it's like you've had to really defend your territory and you feel like you keep fighting but you it's like you have to walk away you know that you just need to walk away from something okay um wow yeah the chariot sideways um it's like things are moving fast and it's almost like it has a good direction and then it loses direction and then it has a good direction and then it loses direction. Okay. So judgment in reverse. This is, it, this is something to do with something. It, it was other factors are at work and it's almost like you had no control over it. Um, and you need to make sure that just as you move ahead, that you're very articulate with what happens. Um, yeah. It could be also that you're sort of separating from something or someone. King of Cups in reverse. So the King of Cups in reverse and the King of Wands in the upright. Um, now, when I speak about kings, okay, a sim of queens, it's not that it's a male. It's a masculine energy, okay? It's Some females have very, very heavy masculine energy. The King of Cups in reverse is with somebody who's very emotionally manipulative, very moody and volatile, right? Um, and it's it's almost like you need to just say it's over. And you have a king of wands in the upright. Now, this is somebody who's very um, a visionary, right? So this is somebody who is um, a passionate leader and creative um, and takes away obstacles. And I think that this is sort of the energy that you need to bring in is this King of Wands energy to get through this. Two of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, things were very unbalanced. Ten of Wands in reverse. This is about a burden being lifted. This imbalance is going to start balancing itself out. Ten of Cups in reverse. Yeah, so there's been delays, but I think that through all these delays that have happened, I think that you've just gained more and more knowledge so that you're ready to clean it up and to take care of this. Because really, at the end of the day, you want this. You want all the good things. Who doesn't, right? But I think that deep down inside, you know exactly what you need to do. There's some sort of situation that's been holding you back and you just need to let go of that.
Okay. Uh, so over here, okay, we have the Four of Cups and the Two of Wands. It's almost like you you didn't know. I, I don't know if you weren't seeing what was being handed to you. I think that it was there, but you just didn't know what to take from it. I hear, like, you have the Two of Wands. I think that you have, um, you really want to, I'm really hearing that you really want to travel. Um, whether that's just moving forward and making choices to move in a new direction, right? You want to get things under your control. Because, yeah, look at this. You have the Two of Pentacles in reverse again, okay? There's things that are so out of balance and disorganized. And I think that you're having or you did have a really hard time with this person pretending that things are good, right? It's almost like it takes every single thing um, in you. And the big thing about the Two of Pentacles in reverse is that it's really telling you that you have to have faith in yourself. Page of Swords in reverse, King of Wands in reverse, yeah, you, you have somebody or a group of some things that are trying to really steal your thunder. Three of Wands in reverse, Queen of Pentacles in reverse, Hierophant in reverse, Page of Pentacles in the upright. It's almost like you have to go against um, something that you grew up believing was true and was real, right? You have to go against this limiting belief of a, like some sort of establishment, right? It could be going against, um, you, you just need to figure out a way to go against certain things so that you can continue to, uh, get out of this, right? Cause you are going to have this, this new opportunity, but there's something in your energy that you have to get rid of. And you're your nine of pentacles somewhat in reverse here and this is almost like you're you're lonely and like you're trying you're depending on somebody else for your success and I don't think that's a good place to be in there's somebody that doesn't want you to be successful queen of pentacles in reverse is an imbalance between work and family and yourself right? Um, yeah. Guys, this is a crazy reading, but there's some, there's something that you have got to get working on, right? Clean it up, right? Round and round. It's like, oh, not this again. It's like, well, why does it keep coming around? And why, what's blocking me from getting to my treasure? What's stopping me? Okay. Cause it's there. It's there for you. Okay, guys. So thank you so much for watching. Please do like and subscribe again. I do apologize. I don't think I'm going to be able to manage bonuses because I got to get going when I'm done with these with the November readings. So thank you so much. I do appreciate it. I hope you guys had a happy birthday and I will see you in your next reading.